Climate change is what you didn't anticipate when you planted that seed. Climate change is whether you're going to have an early drought or whether you're going to have an early flood and whether you're ready for it. And the problem is that you couldn't have known that when you planted that seed. If you think about the impact of rice on greenhouse gas emissions, whether it's CO2 or methane, it contributes a significant portion to those numbers, driving and impacting climate change, which ultimately ends up impacting the crop. Hiện nay thì chúng ta có nhiều các kỹ thuật để có thể cải tiến và thích ứng được với lại biến đổi khí hậu. Tuy nhiên, hội nghị này còn mở ra một cái chương trình mới có nghĩa rằng là không chỉ những người trồng lúa mà là các quốc gia trồng lúa có thể tiến lại gần với nhau và cùng chia sẻ À, những cái khó khăn trong biến đổi khí hậu đồng thời tìm ra được những cái phương tiện cũng như là các cái phương pháp để à, có thể thích ứng được với những thách thức càng ngày càng nhiều hơn. We need to be able to increase the productivity of the systems as well as address climate. If we combine direct feeding rice with AWD or maybe even perennial rice, we can reduce methane emissions. That leaves us with very significant remaining challenges that we're all faced with now as we contemplate climate change. And that's simply because climate change requires dynamic thinking. IRC gave us the opportunity to learn from different various scientists all across the globe who are working on this, uh, on climate change mitigation strategies. But now many, many other areas discover how they contribute to the climate change mitigation agenda. Most of the developing countries, they are facing many challenges, like uh, population growth, this is very challenging. Also, climate change also is another issue. So the message is we have to act now, not tomorrow, in doing some mitigation strategies in, in all of our cropping systems and our, in all agricultural sector. The pandemic has brought challenges and uncertainties in our research, but Erie kept moving forward, proposing new projects. Together with the private sector and utilizing cutting-edge technologies, addressing climate change has evolved into a more interdisciplinary effort. So DSR, for example, is very prominently uh, featured at this uh, IRC and has a strong mitigation potential. But also at the Hybrid Rice Symposium, uh, we have many talks uh, about greenhouse gas emissions and how hybrids can play a role in climate change mitigation. To address different aspects and challenges of climate change through promoting carbon market projects. It definitely gave us new perspectives and new ideas as to how we can go back and apply it. So, our role is to make sure that technology is not only uh, uh, confined to the labs or only with the scientists, but more importantly, how we can take this to the farmers, because that's where the action happens and we can combat this issue of climate change.